back here fixing up the tires on the 7200 planter, deer planter, the bushings, not bushings, but the bearings and the seals on the old axles were wobbly and bad. Not bad, bad, but bad enough. And so while I had the two tires out to uh, put new tires on, because they were cracked and needed to be changed, I took out and will replace seal, bearing, race. There's the new stuff. There's the old shaft. Um, and also, here's the hub I took out of the one that was missing. But it was supposed to have, from the factory, a grease zerk in each one. There's no way to grease these bearings, and the technical manual says make sure you pack the inside with grease before you put it back together again. But there was no provision for that. There's no zerk. There's no way to grease them once it's back together. And uh, Dad and I went back and forth a little bit. He said, well, it's lasted this long. Why change it now? On the other hand, the deer service guy said, well, it's meant to have a zerk. It needs to be greased. And I'm like, I'm here. Why wouldn't I do it? So I am much like I quote unquote play at being a mechanic, I'm playing at being a machinist. I think I've got a pretty good setup, a little unorthodox with the wood, but I'm supporting it with a little tiny V block and it's not that much pressure. So uh, number three drill bit, the quarter 28 I think is what the threads are. And I'll put the tap follower in there once you take the bit out and screw the zerk in and that should be that. And then start putting the new bearings and the races back in. So thanks for watching. Uh, we'll catch you on the next one. Goodbye.